we're going to take a look at how do I create folders in my H drive. And we're going to use the H drive as a temporary storage space. So we're going to be using Google Drive for online storage and H drive for temporary storage. And we're going to create a list of all of these folders are going to be on our H drive so we have a place to put these anytime we need to save to your H drive. So you may have some instructions inside of Schoology that says save to your H drive and so you'll already have the folders created where you're going to save those. We do that by coming down here on our taskbar. We see a little yellow manila folder sitting inside of a blue holder. We click on that. This is what opens up Windows Explorer. And I can get to my H drive one of two ways. I can expand this computer menu, and you're going to see your student number, which is actually going to be your H drive. If you can't see it, I may have to slide this over so you can see the full path. You'll be able to see the drive letter H. So if I click on it here, it's going to bring me to my H drive. Or if I click on computer, and then I can double click my student number or your H drive here, it'll take you to your H drive. And in your case, it's simply going to be your student number or your username. I'm going to create a new folder by clicking on this button. And I'm going to create a folder called TV7. If I hit enter, then adds that text to that folder. I'm going to double click on there. Then here is where I'm going to create all of these folders inside of my H drive. And I can do that by bouncing back and forth between these two windows. But the easiest way to do this might be to restore down a smaller version of Windows Explorer. And I could also restore down a smaller version of Chrome. So I could put these two windows side by side. And this will allow me to create my folders while I'm viewing the names of each of these folders. So then I would come inside of my H drive TV7, make a new folder. I would call this, hit enter, choose new folder again. Now I'll just continue. And I'll just continue to create new folders until I get done creating all the ones that I'm going to need.